What causes the range in my Tesla to go up and down? Well, I'm frugal Tesla guy, and we're going to discover what Tesla has to say about that in the second of a series I like to call Your Battery According to Tesla. Before continuing with this video, I recommend watching the first in this series called What Your Rated Range Really Means, because I think it will help with the references I make in this video easier to understand. I'll have a link to it in the description below, or you can click the video card in the upper right portion of the screen. So if you indeed watched the first video in this series, you now understand once and for all what that rated range or displayed range really means but it still doesn't answer why it fluctuates up and down, creating a lot of frustration and concern for a lot of Tesla owners, especially when they see it go down. Almost everyone's initial reaction is battery degradation. But as we learned in the first video, Tesla states that, quote, it's natural for this, the displayed range, to fluctuate due to the nature of battery technology and how the onboard computer calculates range, unquote. After digging a little deeper, I discovered Tesla expands on this by stating, quote, it is normal for estimated range to decrease slightly over the first few months before leveling off. Over time, you may see a gradual but natural decrease in range at full charge, unquote. Now, you may have seen this chart or slight variations of it wandering around the internet and it certainly is backed up by Tesla's statement that I just mentioned. This, to me, sounds a little like Tesla's very brief and simple way of explaining battery degradation, and really doesn't answer a lot of questions and concerns. But I wanted to actually see them use the word degradation, and here's the only place I could find it on their website. As they went on to say, quote, your Tesla will inform you in the unlikely event a hardware issue is causing excessive battery range or degradation. That's it. Nothing else about battery degradation. I even reached out to my local Tesla service center and mentioned I will be doing a series of videos about the battery and ask specific questions about degradation and another popular topic, battery calibration, which we'll go over in a different video. But all I got out of them is they love my YouTube channel, number one, of course, right? And regarding battery questions, information and tips can be found on their website. And they gave me this link. Hardly the inside information I was looking for. But I digress. And we move on from degradation and look at the complete opposite. When you actually see the range go up on a full charge. Now take a look at this graph from Stats app. It displays the daily average efficiency across all users of the app. The ridges indicate higher efficiency during the warmer months of the year, and as a result, more range. The troughs show lower efficiency during the colder winter months when there is also less range. Now I know I mentioned in the very beginning I wouldn't use any source of information outside of Tesla during this series but it does help illustrate what Tesla says about fluctuating range. Quote, it's natural for estimated range to change, particularly over time or with a recent change in temperature, unquote. So going back to what we learned about the displayed range in the first video, we know it isn't impacted by your driving habits, but it is impacted by the temperature. And Tesla expands on this by saying, quote, Range can be impacted by extreme hot or cold temperatures. However, the impact will seem far more noticeable in cold weather." Unquote. Now this certainly explains the big drop in efficiency and many times the range will see a drop as well during the colder winter months, as illustrated by the Stats app. They then go on to say, quote, Tesla high voltage batteries are regulated to keep the battery temperature within optimal boundaries. Even if the vehicle is not being operated, the high voltage battery temperature is monitored and regulated to prolong its lifespan and performance." Unquote. In conclusion, 
What we've learned in this video is the estimated or displayed range can be impacted by the outside temperature, which can explain fluctuations in the range. A drop in your range after a full charge can mean one of two things, or in some cases, both. Number one, natural battery degradation, or number two, a recent drop in the outside temperature. Since the battery is more efficient in warmer temperatures, you may start to see an increase in your range after a full charge. We also learned that Tesla does not have much to say about battery degradation on their website or even the owner's manual, continuing to leave many in the dark when they start seeing alarming drops in the displayed range. Well, hopefully this video has helped at least some of you to better understand some of the fluctuations you may have been seeing in your displayed range since you've owned the car. Now, I'd like to go back to one of the Tesla quotes for some of the new Tesla owners out there. Quote, it is normal for estimated range to decrease slightly over the first few months. Again, I repeat, the first few months before leveling off, unquote. Now, this helps explain early signs of degradation for many new Tesla owners. And according to Tesla, not me, to Tesla, this is normal. This is obviously a very sensitive topic, and I do expect there to be a lot of comments about this. So number one, please remember to be kind and gentle with one another. And number two, remember not to shoot the messenger. Because as I stated earlier, this is all about what Tesla has to say about the battery and no one else. And I'm only using information from the Tesla website and the owner's manual so as to avoid any misinformation. So keep that in mind as you start typing. In the meantime, be sure to watch for my next video in this series, Your Battery According to Tesla, as we take a look at what Tesla recommends to help increase your efficiency and as a result, your range. Until then, you know the drill. Like, subscribe, and stay positively charged.